take to get your first deal? And what I mean by deal, if you're brand new, you've never seen me, you clicked on this video. When I say deal, we're talking about the DRE business model, digital real estate business model, also known as rent, then rank or rank and rent. And what we mean by a deal is getting a business owner to pay you X amount of dollars every single month to rent your leads, to rent your website. How long does it take? How long should it take? I'm going to answer all those questions in this video, but I'm going to keep it as succinct as possible and to the point. I think that's the right word. That, that sounded kind of cool. Succinct. I heard that, I think, two days ago, and I'm going to use it, and boom, was able to use it. Um, guys, I have seen people in my program, so I'm just going to go off of data. I have seen people in my program that have gotten deals literally in their first seven days, okay? I have also seen people that have come into my program, gotten sidetracked, started chasing this, started doing that. Oh, going to go do Forex. Oh, going to go do drop shipping. Oh, it, it works for everybody else, but doesn't work for me and not get a deal, right? So how long should it take? Because how long is it going to take is going to depend largely on you and how much effort you put into it and how, how well you actually follow the system. And are you doing this on your own? Are you following my program? Are you following somebody else's program? Are you, this is another important thing, guys. Are you doing it rank and rent model, which is the slow, antiquated, old school way of doing it? Or are you doing it the way it should be done, in my opinion, which is rent first, use other people's money to build out the asset, and continue to scale using other people's money, OPM, baby, other people's money. There's a lot of different variables here, but what I would tell you is that if you get into this business and you cut out all the fluff and you cut out you know, the, the analysis paralysis and uh, gotta watch a hundred sales videos and, and get pumped up and do all this and you just did the bare minimum and you went in and said, hey, I'm gonna pick a niche like concrete. And I'm going to go and I'm going to pick a city and I'm going to make sure the city is less than $5 CPC and it's not too competitive. By the way, I have my own framework and I have a complete training on how to pick a city and niche, which is probably the most important part of the entire process. It makes or breaks a deal. But if you're not in there, obviously you don't have that. Um, but let's say you go and you pick a city and it's at least $5 CPC or less. So, you know, you're going to get decent uh, clicks on your ads and probably going to convert. You do a decent landing page. Guys, there is no reason, there is no reason on God's green earth that you should not be able to get a deal within 30 days. Within 30 days. It's not that I've seen one person get a deal in 30 days. It's that I've seen person after person after person land their first deal within 30 days. And they probably could have and should have landed it quicker. But if they looked at it, they went, well, I took a while to decide on the city took a while to decide on the niche. I wasted a few days because I got sick. I wasted a few days because I didn't dare call anyone and I couldn't will myself to call or it was the holidays, whatever other excuse people make. But if you sat down and you were, you had the exact blueprint, the exact framework, what's a good niche? What's a good city? I'm telling you what's a good niche, concrete, dude. Like it's not that complicated. That's a good one. Now, now you're going to have to look. A lot of people doing concrete, you're gonna have to look hard. You're gonna have to find that city. You're not just gonna go pick your first city. And let me give you a pro tip. If you can see it, if you open up your maps and you can see the city without zooming in, probably not a good city. It's probably been looked at a hundred times. So just a little tip, okay? But if you were to follow the exact process and you did it, and you did it exactly how you should have done it, and what I mean when I say should have, you didn't waste time in between. and You didn't get sidetracked by this or that or the rest. You, there's no reason you shouldn't be able to make money within 30 days. Okay. Now there's other variables. People have kids, people have obligations, people have full-time jobs. They can't get to it. They got work that like really demands their time. Maybe they're in accounting and it's that time of year. We, I understand. Okay. But I just want to let you know the possibility. Again, we've had people make, get deals within seven days, man, seven days days. They get in, they're like, Hey, I'm just going to follow Nick's method. I'm going to choose concrete. I'm going to choose his, I'm going to use his exact criteria for choosing the city. I'm going to make sure my CPC is under five bucks. I'm going to use a script. I'm going to use all these different things. Boom, 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 boom. I'm going to see if it works and boom, boom, boom. They go and they close their first deal. Okay. We've seen that. There is no reason you shouldn't be able to get your first deal in 30 days. Now, if you're doing it the rank and rent method, which is the slow way, which is build the website that you don't even know is in the right area. You don't even know if there's a business owner that's going to be willing to buy your leads, right? You're doing it literally the old school way. 
you're not even going to be talking about getting a deal for four to six months until that sucker starts like getting leads and consistent leads, right? Because just because you get your first lead, that doesn't mean you're going to get 15 to 20 leads a month, right? If you can't get 12 to 20 leads a month, how are you going to sell a flat fee deal for anything that's decent? You're, it's going to be really difficult. So you're going to end up going and doing a paper lead deal and then you're going to try and convert them and they're not going to want to convert because that's like giving your kids dessert first for a month and then switching them over to vegetables before the dessert just doesn't work. So there's a lot of variables, but assuming that you did the rank and rent model, assuming that you followed my blueprint exactly, which is what I outlined in the program, assuming that you just chose the niche and, and didn't overthink the city and the niche, but you did follow the criteria and you did took action, you took action, you took action and you sat down and you hooked the business owner. And if you had to call all day to hook the business owner, you did it and you didn't cave into your fear. There's no reason you wouldn't be able to get a deal within 30 days. We had a month. Uh, in 2021, where we did over $20,000, over $20,000 in new business, y'all, in new contracts, in new money. We weren't making the month before this in August of 2021. It was phenomenal. Now, I also had a setter. I also had a project manager. I also had VAs. I was just doing the sales. But that point is, if I can do 20000 plus actually 24000 if I can do $24,000 in new business in a month, what could you do? You don't think you could get a deal? The reason if you're not or you're, you can't wrap your head around it, it's probably because you're doing it the antiquated way and you're listening to people that do not make money doing this. They make money because they're selling you and teaching you how to do this. But ask the tough questions, guys. Take advice from people that you would trade places with, not from people that say just speak to speak. Okay, that's how quickly you should be able to do it. There's no reason you couldn't do it in 30 days um, if you're actually following and doing and not having analysis paralysis. I'm out.